good morning guys and welcome to this weekend in my life vlog the sun is crazy it is about 9 40 and we got some vultures out yo come on vultures let like let's move it anyway there's this like road um to get to my house and you know there's just wildlife everywhere but today I'm going to cycle bar. I really don't wanna go. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, which you totally should, I posted that I went on a run because the day was like so beautiful. And honestly, it was like such a good run. Like it was the perfect weather for a run. It was daytime. I normally never run like when the sun's up. If I am gonna run, I'm gonna, I wait till like it gets dark or I just wake up early before the sun comes up because it's just too hot in Florida but that day it was like so good so I finished up what I needed to do for school and everything and then I went on a run but I will say I am so sore I woke up the next day it was Friday because I went on a run Thursday and I was so sore and I'm still so sore and I really don't feel like going to cycle bar but because I haven't like been in quite a while um I want to go because it's a service and like luxury I'm paying for so yeah I'm definitely gonna go okay I just need to turn on my GPS to make sure I'm like going the right way because there's so many different ways to get to this cycle bar for me again I love this one because it's only 20 minutes away from my house so much more convenient than the other one I do this I'm gonna run to the store real quick Later today, we're getting our bar stools, which is going to be fun. And I'm excited to see what they look like with our table. And then what else are we doing? Tomorrow, my parents are actually doing a day trip to Tampa. I'm not going because, okay, so they're going to see Hamilton and unpopular opinion. I really just don't like Hamilton. I'm just not a really big history buff. I think everyone who's in it is talented and everything. I love Broadway and shows and musicals but it's just really expensive to go to those shows so i decided to opt out of that one because i honestly just don't really like hamilton if i'm being honest one really cool thing about when i go to hamlin i always cut through disney so i always get to see the sign when i go to my workout class i also want to say it is so cold here i had my black a line jacket on and I'm like no I need something heavier so I quickly just put on this jacket and this is the scuba half zip and I love it but if you follow me on TikTok I posted what this girl said it's like the hood is so heavy that it like chokes you and I'm not a big fan of it um, that's why I only have this one because I do like the jacket it's just like it's weird but I definitely needed something heavier because I'm like ooh this little jacket's not Use going to be enough to take the ramp to Disney's Hollywood Studios. I'm also wearing a thicker workout set it's the Gymshark one I'm wearing this thick um, set from Gymshark and I like Gymshark but their stuff's just way too thick in the grand scheme of things but it's perfect for days like today when it's like so cold and you know you need a little bit of thicker material so I do not match whatsoever. So it's gonna be like funky going to uh, going into the store looking like this. Cause I normally have like a cute outfit on, but you know, we're not gonna do that because it's just too cold and I don't have anything that like really matches. Florida doesn't get cold like this very often. So it's fine if I like don't match like one day, it's fine. Also too, I was watching Aspen's vlog and um, she was saying that she normally like listens to YouTube videos, which is so true. I listen to YouTube videos in the car and everything. So that's why I really don't mind having long clips like this. She was kind of saying that in her video and I was like, okay girl, yes, because I typically like fast forward anything like with music. Like I can't watch it cause I listen to YouTube videos in the car. So I kind of just like skip, skip, skip. And then I listen to the video rather than watch it. So that's one thing I love about YouTube. Like I can more so listen to it rather than watch. Like TikTok and Instagram like has to have my, not full, full attention, but like more attention than YouTube, which really sucks because then it just takes away time that like 
you know, because sometimes I can listen to YouTube videos and, like, do homework, but, like, on TikTok or Instagram, like, I have to, that's more visual, and it's, like, I have to look at it, so it takes more time away from my studies, which really sucks. That's why I haven't really, like, been too, too active on those platforms anymore, um, but, oh my gosh, guys, okay, so last thing I want to talk about before, like, I put this camera down. I worked so hard, so hard on this reel or TikTok or whatever for Fabletics and I posted it on my YouTube channel as well. Um, so go like it if you haven't. Go to my shorts tab and like it. I spent like a good evening filming that, editing that, and posting that and it has 250 views. Like that's the reason why like I typically don't put a lot of effort, but because I get cool, because I get to work with Fabletics, like, I do spend time on that content, but still, it's so frustrating. Like, I spent a lot of time on that, so I really am crossing my fingers that that performs, like, okay on Instagram when I post it, because I haven't posted it on Instagram yet, so I don't know, guys. It's just one of those things I'm like, I actually worked hard on that, and, like, for it to not like be seen by anyone like it's sad all right i'm gonna cut the clip here i know this is kind of rambly but again i listen to youtube videos and i just like talking to you guys so i am gonna cut it off here okay so i made it to cycle bar and i honestly am going to just take it easy and have fun which you should always do but like I'm gonna really take it easy because I swear I guess when you run you just use different muscles because I am just so sore I can't get over it I haven't been this sore in a long long time it's probably because I do the same thing over and over again which is not good that's why I think like when the gym across the street from my house like gets done I'm gonna do like multiple different things because I want to like strengthen a lot of different things and work out a lot of different muscles. Not me getting an ice drink when it's like literally 40 something degrees out, but yeah, you're looking at someone who gets an ice drink because, okay, so hot drinks, I get them sometimes, I'm not going to lie, like the sugar cookie almond milk latte, I get that iced and hot, it's really good, chai tea, I drink hot and cold. But the thing about coffee and just like hot drinks in general, I always end up burning my tongue and I just don't like it as much. Like, let's be real. So that's why I'm drinking this. I can just warm up my car and drink my <laughs> iced drink. And now I don't know, this is like such a first world problem, but okay. So I was going to get Starbucks on Monday at the normal Starbucks like kind of near my house and I wanted to get it Monday instead of Friday because it was the first official Monday back to school and I'm like you know what I'll just start out the week with a good coffee and the week will go up from here you know it was under construction and I knew whenever it's not on the mobile order app I should just know but I was having like really high hopes about the Starbucks. So I'm like, okay, maybe they just don't have enough people to work the mobile order section. Like, I don't know. So I don't know. I end up driving there. I'm like, I'll just order there. And the whole thing, and there was other people, I wasn't the only one going into the star, like not going in, but like driving by the Starbucks literally and seeing it's just like all getting re like renovated. Yeah. I was like getting renovated and I did not get any Starbucks, which was not that big of a deal, but it would have been nice to start out the week. But now I'm finishing the week with Starbucks because there's not really a close Starbucks. Like there's a Starbucks downtown celebration. There's a lot of stoplights. It just takes a long, like more of a process to get there. So like maybe on a Sunday, like I could go downtown and just get a Starbucks. Or when I go to Cycle Bar, it's a nice little treat after. And there's one like a minute away from Cycle Bar Hamlin. So I just chose the route, go to work out and then get a treat after. I definitely know I need to go to the store. Like I always do, I need to pick up some salad materials and a few other things. Like I started my period today guys and like, that's another reason too why I'm like probably so sore, not only from the run, but like, so I need to go to the store. I'm thinking about just like hitting up Target 
to make this vlog a little bit different. Like I like to add some variation. So we'll see, it depends on traffic and like the time and stuff because I need to get home, eat, shower, all the things because our chairs are getting delivered today from, it could be like 2.15 to like six something. So I just like need to be there and ready for that. I'm excited to see what they look like. Okay, so made it to Target. You can barely see the logo, but it's fine. I forgot the Target is like a grocery store too. So brought my bag and hopefully they'll like have all the stuff I need. Like I'm pretty sure they will, but let's see. Finish the coffee. I'm freezing and I'm still in this mismatched outfit. We love. Nothing like doing your grocery shopping at Target. <laughs> Also too guys, I can't believe I did this messy bun and it actually turned out pretty good. Like, I'm always pretty bad at the messy buns. Ooh, look at how good this looks. Target has some like good lettuce options. We got the organic. I think I'm gonna land on this one though. It's probably overly priced, but it's fine. It's like, it looks good quality, so that's all I can really ask. And I just wanna stop by to see the decor. That's why I'm here pretty much. I haven't been to Target since like the holidays, so we'll get this. And I think I need cucumber. I don't know where that is though. Oh, there's the meats. I know I need some meat. Gosh, I'm so cold. Okay, I didn't come here for creamer, but it's good to know that they have like all these creamers stocked up. I would like to try that one. That one looks pretty cool. I found everything, but I wasn't gonna pay like that much for green pepper, so like. I'm just gonna stick to these and that. I'll give it to Target for all the grocery shopping, but all my, oh, those are peanuts. I thought it was the pretzels. So there's these pretzels that we eat in class and they're so good. They're in a bag that kind of like looks like that. Um, I'll put a picture on the screen um, if I still have it. But anyway, these things, one girl was eating those. Oh my gosh, they're so good, man. Back to looking for what we actually need. Ooh, Triscuits. Also guys, these are so good. I am obsessed with them, but I'm not gonna get them today. I was contemplating on getting them, but I'm like, no, we gotta be healthy. So I am craving though some chips, like obviously, but I'm trying to be a lot better. So I'm gonna get the baked lays. Probably not like better, but like better than like Doritos. Doritos. Two for $7. Cause I normally eat pretzels at school cause they're just like not messy and everything and they don't get your hands like all like gross. So, but I don't want to have like pretzels on the weekends. You know what I mean? Like it's too much of the same thing. Guys, I don't need to put a picture on the screen because I found them here. Okay, I my day is made. Such a good snack. These are addicting, you'll eat the whole bag. All right guys, I also got some peanuts because I always need something like a snack after eating my meal. I don't know why, it's just one of those things, but peanuts are good because they're like a fat, but they don't have like a lot of carbs, I guess. I don't know, this is what I was eating when I was like kind of more, a lot more strict about my diet and stuff. Yeah, don't pay attention to the dots because I just needed to get those. We just need a few more things, a couple more things, and then I'm just gonna like mosey around Target because I want to. It's fun. It's relaxing. Ooh, the throw blanket section. I think I'm headed the wrong way. I'm literally just wandering around aimlessly now. I'm in the tech section right now. The lighting in here is great. Also too, I should get a thumbnail because why not? But there's a lot of people in this section because it's like the toy section. <laughs> so I need to find like a quiet aisle. All right. They already put out all the Valentine's stuff. How fun. I also hate Valentine's Day too. It's New Year's or Valentine's Day. Those two like holidays, not a fan of whatsoever. Oh my gosh, my cart. But anyway, it's a good little shelf to set your cars up on. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, so leave in the comments down below your favorite candy. If you get to this part, oh my gosh, my camera battery's gonna die. I'll just let it die whenever it decides to poop out, but 
leave in the comments down below your favorite candy like what would you want to get on valentine's day oh mine would be like reese's probably oh my gosh there it is should i buy it for myself i'm just kidding no i'm not gonna buy it for myself i still like in grade school when you were required to get everyone a valentine's day gift oh man my oh my god look at that Okay, my camera battery decided to die at the most cutest things ever. Like, can we just, yeah, I don't know. This hasn't been charged in a while. But look at the eggs and bacon, the avocado. I can't, the peanut butter and jelly. Valerie was so kind enough to get dinner for us. We were having Panera, and I got a chicken Caesar salad and um, a cookie. This is what I am having, you know, gotta be balanced. Good morning, guys. It is the next day, and I'm headed to, guess where, guess where, Starbucks. I am going to try like the Alex Earl drink, just because I want to, and just on my way there now um i'm not gonna do the mobile order i always do mobile order but like it's just like less convenient um especially when i i just like want to order a drink correctly so i'm just gonna like show the barista like the label because i took a screenshot of it from instagram um and i'm going to the one downtown not orlando celebration because the other one as you guys know it's under construction so i'm going to just like go in real quick hopefully there's not a long line and of course i'm getting an iced drink when it's like 40 degrees out again but it's fine because i'm just gonna take the drink home it's literally like a 10 minute like little venture but yeah i'm going to take the drink back home and enjoy it in like the warm house and also too this outfit if you guys can see I don't really know probably I have the like wide angle um but this outfit is so good because it's like loungewear like I wear this like no bra it doesn't really matter the pants are like loose fitting everything but I can also go out to society and not look like a total slob in this loungewear so it's like perfect because you get the best of both worlds like it's comfortable I feel like I'm in my pajamas but like it's still presentable, you know what I mean? Okay, so I cannot wait to try this drink. I hope it's good. I learned from last time, got the medium of my own drink. So just in case I don't like it, okay. Let's give her a swirl. The cinnamon's on the bottom, but I'm sure it'll like mix in there. Oh my gosh, that is so good. If you don't like cinnamon, don't get it, but it's really good. It's like a cinnamon version of the almond cookie, the almond sugar cookie latte. It's really, really good. That's a hit, definitely a hit, not a miss. I'm glad, but I'm also glad I got my drink just in case I did not like this because it was kind of busy in there and like standing in the line for so long. Like I'm kind of glad I do have my normal order, but this is still really good and I will be finishing this because it is good. I'm happy. Okay, I'm home now and I forgot to show you guys the chairs. Maybe I did show you the chairs, but these are the chairs, really good. They're a lot more sturdy than like the other ones because the other ones are like super, super old. They went with this table. So it's, it seemed like every time you'd sit in them, like you would break the chair, but it just looks so good. Don't mind all the stuff here, but yeah. Okay, so had a little relaxing morning, literally doing nothing. I don't know, I just thought I haven't cleaned my makeup brushes in a long time. And as you guys know, I got a new beauty blender. So I was thinking we should just clean all the brushes too. So like the next time I do my makeup, everything is like cleaned. Because I do have like, you know, well this one I don't really use. But the other ones, 
I am definitely gonna clean because I wanna like, I just wanna make sure everything's clean like the first go around rather than like be reusing things. So that's what I'm gonna do now. It doesn't take too long. I don't have that many brushes anyway. I guess I only have three. I thought I had more than that, to be honest, but what I'm seeing now, I do not see any more brushes in here. So this is gonna be really quick. <laughs> Okay, I also wiped off all the makeup because it has like makeup on it, you know? So I took a wipe and I just like wiped it down and then I used a um, soapy towel to like wash off the makeup remover because like, you know, it kind of has this like weird feeling. And then I took just like a damp paper towel to rinse them. So I like fully clean them because I don't know, I just get grossed out. This, I just took a wipe and I literally just wiped it like gently because I don't want to like ruin this bag so yeah I'm just going to dry off all of these and put them back in the bag the bag isn't perfect like it still has some makeup but it's fine yeah I just want it as clean as possible because like I'm starting fresh you know like I want a clean slate so I'm just coming on here to end this vlog. I got to see some family that I haven't seen in a long time so that was really cool and really fun to catch up with them I didn't like film or anything because I don't know there's some people that I haven't seen in like years I didn't want to like be filming them I kind of just wanted to like visit and like catch up with them but I will flash some photos of me and my great uncle he is I swear like the male version of my grandma and if you guys knew my grandma like you would know like he just is like the male version it's so, like every time I look at him I'm like all I see is my grandma which is like bittersweet because like my grandma's not here anymore so anyway um yeah i'm just gonna end it here i hope you guys enjoyed this little weekend in my life vlog pretty chill which i really needed it guys my legs are still killing me like i think this is the right muscle but it's called the gracilis is still so sore so i will definitely not be going to cycle bar tomorrow because i th still think my legs need a break yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be running anytime soon again. Like I'm s still recovering, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.